the cornerstone. Now, the cornerstone is the first stone that's put down when we build something. And that cornerstone gets placed down and everything after that will be in line with that first stone. So I was thinking about a cornerstone today and how we can decide which cornerstones are good to use and which cornerstones maybe are not as good. So I have some blocks here. I have this one, which is kind of like a, a triangle. And I have this one, which is round, so it'll roll. And I have this one, just a regular block. So if you're gonna start to build maybe a house or a castle with your blocks, which one do you think would be good to use as the first one? The one that all the other ones are gonna line up to. So let's see, if we try to use this one, what might happen? Well, first of all, it's hard to put another one on top of it, right? Cause it's gonna fall down. And let's see if we do it this way, it's gonna slide down. So maybe this one is not so good, right? How about this one? Well, if we put this one down and we put this guy on top, he's gonna tip right off or this is gonna roll away. And even if we put it this way, it's not the most steady. It could easily tip off of here. How about this one? This one looks pretty good. We could pretty much put whatever we want on top of it. We could stack lots of other things. So this one is probably a good cornerstone. Well, this one is like Jesus. These other ones are like other things in our lives. And Jesus is telling us today that he wants us to make him the cornerstone. He wants to be the foundation of everything in our lives because then our lives are gonna be based on love and grace and care for each other and for God and for all of God's creation. So when we think about what we want to let guide our lives and how we want to line up, we should always think about Jesus first because he's the best cornerstone that anyone could ever have. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for Jesus and Jesus for being our cornerstone. Help us to always make sure that we keep you at the center and align our lives in a way that is loving and good. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.